the push-ups. For most people, it's the first body weight exercise they learn how to perform. And once you've done the classic push-up, you're gonna very quickly find out there's a hell of a lot more variations out there. Some easier and some very difficult. And today, me and my brother Brandon are gonna be trying to perform as many as we can. We're gonna start with the beginner stuff and then slowly work into the more expert stuff. And in the process, we're gonna be finding out who's the ultimate buff dude push-up champion. Beginner push-ups are finished, and I gotta say, that, that wasn't too difficult. No, I think that was a good warm-up. Yeah. Got us into the groove. You may have even noticed we were doing a little bit of buff dude choreography there. We we're trying to do it in sync, so if you ever want to learn how to do a buff dude dance, you can just kind of do this with your buddies. You or... can follow along with us. Yeah. I think that's what we're talking about. We're gonna start doing our own push-up classes. <laughs> Instead of step classes, it's, it's buff dude push-up classes. Oh yeah. Look for it soon. Or maybe not. Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> so we're moving on to the next round. We're moving on to hard, which as the name implies, is a little bit more difficult than easy mode. So we're both keeping up with each other at this point. Let's see what's gonna happen. Oh yeah. out of the way and I'm a little happy that one's over. Oh yeah, I'm just glad we survived. It, it was feeling, there's some parts there that were getting a little creaky, I think. I mean, once you start moving in different ways and different angles, you start feeling different areas and especially when you start introducing that kind of like ballistic and plyo kind of sense, your wrists start hurting. So it makes it, it definitely lives up to his name, it's hard mode. Yeah, it gives you false expectations because when you start in beginner, you're doing the kneeling, you're doing the standard, you're really just going in a straight vertical motion. So as Brian was saying, when you're kind of twisting all over the place, your body's feeling it a little bit more. I'm 215 pounds, he's 225. You really, when you're shifting that much meat, it's, uh, <laughs> you know, your joints begin to feel it a little bit. So getting a little nervous, moving on to expert now. Uh, Here's where it gets rough. <laughs> yeah, oh man. Wish us luck. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 
Finnish expert, and we're both still holding in there. Oh yeah, there was uh, there was some different moves in there, and some familiar moves too. The the uh, typewriter was a cool one, yeah. but also the floor seat sweeper ones we've done before in our body weight program. So we're familiar with that one, but I think the hardest one for me was the one arm. Those one arm push ups are tough. It was very difficult. I'm glad we did a little bit of teamwork in that one. Oh yeah, and like you're saying earlier, I mean, the heavier you weigh, the harder these movements become. So. They really are, and then now that we're about 15 push-ups in, you're just beginning to get a little bit more fatigue. So your body's wearing down, but the exercises are also getting harder. We're moving on to the last phase, it's called Buff Dude. It's got the most difficult exercises yet. So far, we've been able to do all these push-ups, yeah. but this, this mode here, Buff Dude mode, there's some pretty tough ones. So we're gonna see if we can do it. The score is tied. It may not be tied going to this <laughs> final round, but we're about to find out, so. I'm very happy the buff dude mode was the last mode because I don't think I could have done any more. Oh yeah, I already feel sore. I uh, was feeling a little confident, did a few that Brandon couldn't do in the beginning, and then he really towed the line in the end with some of those more explosive ones. Those were crazy. My body just couldn't keep up. It was a lot of fun doing these, but I don't feel like you'd probably do these on a regular basis. I'm probably gonna implement the King Kong push-ups into my future workout routines because that's just because I like to go in the gym and assert dominance. I'm oh sure. Going to... <laughs> They should rename that to Alpha Push-Up. Yeah. Because you just go around doing those and scaring all the little betas. <laughs> Either that or end up on one of those top gym fail videos That's that you true. always see in your sidebar. Yeah, which is just a really red chest with bruises and stuff. And everyone's like, what the hell happened? You're like, oh, I beat myself. Yeah. So uh, let us know if you want us to do any more variation videos in the future. Maybe we do squats with another body weight. This was a lot of fun. And uh, till next time. Yeah. 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 That's, what we yeah. do. That's the buff dude language. When we can't think of what to say, we just start beating our chest and snarling. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah.